Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Two Set Bubble Tea. I mean, Two Set Violin. But as you all know, we love drinking bubble tea. Mm. When is a bubble tea company gonna sponsor Two Set Bubble Tea? I know, tea? we're so open. Guys, there's Basically, so much. Basically, we have bubble tea every day. And there's so much opportunity here. Look at all of us. Two Setters love bubble tea. We love bubble tea. Just hit us up. So nice. Sound new. Tote bag. The uh, notes are swimming in the swimming pool. We keep our recording equipment in here when we go recording. We can put sheet music. It's got a little magnetic. It's very strong too. Check it out guys, 2 Thanks for the support. Today we wanted to um, react to some videos of people trying bubble tea. Just to see how people react to this beautiful, miraculous, basically the best drink ever created. Hands down. Let's go. That's so sacrilegious. Dude, so how close were they having the mic to as well? Like, yeah, that's like ASMR. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get that sound. Nah, never drink bubble tea like that. Um, why is there green bubble tea? I love that it says WTF though. And then okay, I love true. how it says trashy for Tara. Cause that's yeah, it is a bit. Cause it's super sweet too. Mm -hmm. And then cute for that. Actually, actually they, they kind of do get it. Yeah. Nice. I guess it's like what melon matcha. But that's not a matcha color. Green. It's too bright. It's too bright for actual matcha. And same with that Tara. It's too bright for Tara. Tara is not that purple, guys. When you're like a great bubble tea drinker or like a great musician, one similarity is you can kind of tell just from looking whether it's going to taste good or not. You can tell whether a musician will sound good or not usually by the posture. Yeah, before they even play. I, I can already tell it doesn't taste good. I'm not sure this is the right type of backing track for this elegant <laughs> drink. They should play the uh, BBT composition. Exactly. Bubble Tea by Jordan Heap. What's that? You haven't heard it? It's because it's coming out in a few days. <laughs> Keep an eye out. Okay, anyway, sorry. Sorry, it's, I know we're a Bubble Tea channel. I'm not supposed to talk about music. They're roasting the editors now. Yeah, sorry. See, because editor San is superior. Thank editor San has good taste in music. Yeah, yeah. I'll ignore that sound. That was, that's no one there. Don't worry. Go back to edit. This is like classic boba. It's sealed. I hope that it tastes like chocolate milk. It's gonna taste a lot better than chocolate Dude, milk. Chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. What in space? <laughs> <laughs> Why is okay? So the first girl. I think she tried a few times. She's fully like yeah, yeah. decimating. But that's that why she's holding thing. it away because it was split. That, like that's why it was come out because you're doing that. You got it right. That second, guy, second, second guy, guy right. Nice. Ooh. Third guy. Don't you shouldn't cover the yeah. Thing. Here's the air oxygen just pff, and the milk. Yeah, he was so nervous. Yeah, yeah. it is pretty scary. Like yeah. if you're a first time rookie, you know. Ooh. It just felt like tadpoles flew in my mouth. Little known fact: Did you know the balls are actually cooked tadpoles? Yeah, it's coated in tapioca. Mm. But it's actually tadpoles. Mm. Frog eggs. They harvest them in Asia. <laughs> yeah. Just joking. It's a joke. It's a joke. Okay. It's a joke. It's a joke. It's a joke. I don't know how I feel about chewing these weird gummy things. It's like chewing on a trampoline. Dude, that is the weirdest. Chewing on a trampoline. Maybe it's just. I, I'm also suspicious of how good the okay. bubbles are. Yeah, to right? be fair, like they had some weird ass colors. So yeah. I wouldn't put a pass on for having not so good bubble tea. Okay, so the bubbles really define how good a bubble tea is. And I think the premium bubbles, they're not too chewy where it feels like it hurts your jaw. Yes. But they also have enough bounce and they've got like the sweet flavor. Yeah. Because you also don't want it to be too soggy. soggy yeah, yeah, if soggy is like sticky, it's not nice. I'm like pleasantly surprised. Nice! It was either one that said chocolate milk. Yeah. Okay. Well, I guess if you was expecting chocolate milk, of course. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the tea is delicious. It's very similar to like this Indian cha. I like it, but I don't get it. It's like expecting to get a Game Boy for Christmas, and then your parents get you a Game Boy Advance. Yeah. That's a beautiful metaphor. Yeah, yeah. This looks like a witch's brew. I have no idea what taro is. Oh, that's good. I'm sorry, that's just so stereotypical. Yeah. It's a bit of a trend that we see where yeah. most of our Australian friends, for some reason, our Aussie it. friends just love Tara. And because it's so sweet. It is sweeter. Tara, I think it's nice for like two sips and then you're done. It's like too OP. Oh, in your face. But they just love it. I really like it. I like it more than the first one. For rookies, the Tara tastes better. Use the Tara as a little gateway to step them in. It just, always works. But yeah. as you ascend the sophistication ranks. Dude, then it becomes like about the tea mm -hmm. and that's 
Just a little sugar and you're good. It's a floral kind of sweet potato kind of flavor. Sweet, but not too sweet. Chewing on something matches the flavor of what's going on here. I would prefer the tea without the boba. Mm. It's so basic for just drinking milk tea. I think it's really cool because it's like you're having a drink while you're eating a dessert at the same yeah, time. Yeah, see? Two and one. Yeah. It's efficient. Last one. Oh my Honeydew God. milk tea. This does not look natural at all. Yeah. This <laughs> guy's all good. He knows what's probably up. Isn't. Probably isn't. This is really good. Mm -mm. <laughs> no! Yeah. yeah, no. Whoa. That tastes exactly like honeydew. So sweet and so sour at the same time. It's not overly powerful, it's not too sweet. This makes the most sense to chew the balls. Because you're used to chewing when you eat honeydew. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> Maybe I need to go out and start drinking more boba tea. It almost makes drinking tea stressful. I'm a convert. I like the squishy. I would drink this now. I'm glad I tried it. Nice. I'm glad you guys tried it too. Welcome to the fam. <laughs> Check out our bubble tea tier list. <laughs> While you're at it, listen to classical yeah. music. Because <laughs> that's what our channel is about. Yeah. All right, next video. Today, you'll be eating this. Ew. <laughs> Yeah, look how they're presented <laughs> to a little kid. Yeah, you have seen it. I can imagine. Yeah, so what like, is that? Ugh, sticky. Ugh. Is this boba? It smells like dark chocolate. Ooh, I want to eat it. <laughs> Took a look at him. I like Lucas. Yeah, yeah, Lucas is on it. Lucas knows. Yeah. Lucas is cultured. Yeah. Ooh, I, it's boba! Oh! Yo! He's like, yo! It's like he won an Olympic medal. He's like, yes! Yeah. Dude, this guy's the best. Lucas. I love you. Let me give you a hug first. Lucas is what we feel inside when we see bubble tea. Yeah, that's true. That's yeah. true. Every time we order bubble teas, it's like, oh, yes. I don't know what it is. Can I spit it out? Dude, she's like not enjoying it at all. Dude, she's just struggling. Hmm, I don't know if I like it or not. It's kind of like bitter. You know what? Because I think they're kids, so they taste the tea. The taste buds not ready for the tea flavor. Because when you're a kid, I think it's less developed, right? You're a bit more sensitive. Like the first time you're having coffee. It's like, That's true. You know? As a kid, you don't like coffee. Yeah, so I think the tea makes it taste bitter. It's boba. It's so boba. So she's got to like it. She's got to like, like it. it. It's, yes. It's, it's good. He, he's going to like it. Ugh. I don't like that part. The only thing I like is the drink. Lucas, you betrayed us. Lucas. What happened? I trusted you, man. Yeah. How could you just why, why take our trust in you and, and just destroy it like that? It like sticks to my braces. It was really hard to get down. It would be annoying if the pearls is really sticky. Then yes, it can get stuck in braces. I know because I used to have braces. Not fun at all. You just drank milk tea with boba. That sounds disgusting. This coffee tea is delicious. I have to say that. I'm sorry for overreacting, but this is delicious. Oh, yeah, I like she, her. She's got it down. It's delicious. It's delicious. Yeah. Correct. Do you recommend that people try boba tea? Oh. No. No. Yes. I think so, yeah. <laughs> no. This is gross. I think you should try it. It's really not that bad. Yeah. Yes! Because it delicious. Yeah, he likes yes. it now. Yes! Let's try it. It's amazing. It's like what? a I'm good so drink confused. Drink. Does he like it. it or not like it? Dude, yeah, I don't think he has an opinion. He's just... He's toying with my emotions. Yeah, I want boba now. To be honest though, don't drink it too much. Just maybe like once a day is enough. Mm-hmm. You know what I should do? We should make some bubble tea. <laughs>